What's up guys? I'm on a rooftop here and I hope I can pull off this video before the Samsung phone overheats. So just got done getting some pumps fixed down in the central plant for this place for the chilled water. The uh, pumps died, both of them. And what I found out was the EMS wigged out and it was shutting isolation valves to the cooling towers while the pumps were still running. Basically ran the pumps out of water and burned them, seized them, seized the pump and fried the other one too. So, uh, so now just replaced two pumps, put some more photos on the screen there and uh, got those up and running. And now I'm up here looking at this, uh, what this company come up and put in its temporary cooling system, portable units. They're sitting on the ground down below. I'll put some still images up on the screen of those. These units use 100% outside air, sucked it through a panel, through some filters, up into these ducts coming up on the roof, and they put a piece of wood in the door on each air handler and ducked it into there. Now, the customer here says these haven't really cooled the building at all. Well, I could kind of see why. The company that installed those did not shut down the fans, and these are those reversed, inclined, high static blowers well, a little piece of crap like this through the spiral duct isn't going to compete with the static pressure generated from these blowers. So it probably had hard, hard already any airflow into the unit. <laughs> and they did it on both of them. One of two things these guys screwed up when they installed this. So either one was they, just, they meant to turn off the fans and they didn't. And they just want to use the sheer pressure of their units to push air into the, just through the unit. Or they thought this was the return side and intended to utilize the blower of the unit. Probably would have provided good airflow if they would have done that, but the return is over here on that one. And likewise on this one's a flip unit. That's the intake. See, there's your out fresh air intake. That's the return coming up from the building. That's the supply. All the supply ducts are connected to the supply of the units with the fans running. They didn't get shite for airflow. So, yeah, lame. So, yeah. I just thought you guys get a kick out of that. So, the pump, the EMS, I reset. I came up here to reset the EMS boards on everything. There's like, it hit like a weird fault in the programming or something. I noticed right before those pumps failed that one of these units was cycling the blower off and on randomly from the EMS. I've been telling this customer they need to get controls out here, go through these oddball units check out the controls but they still haven't so now they just lost many thousands of dollars for the pumps that they just had to get replaced and then now they've probably spent who knows how much on that portable ac this didn't work so i had the system running great overnight on manual overriding all the ems control just manually opening certain isolation valves and the compressor and the pumps and fine i reset these boards now i'm putting it back on automatic so far i think it's working so We'll see.